speak of football, Josh Allen, where does it stand with football? Josh Allen, we have one of the bigger mysteries heading into this week of football. Josh Allen, where does it stand with his elbow that got hit right at the end of that game last week? Here's my understanding of where it stands, guys. Josh Allen believed to be dealing with an elbow sprain, a UCL sprain, uh, which is something actually he has had in the past, not considered to be a major, major injury, which means the belief is that it is something that he can play through. I'm not saying that he is definitively playing this week. That is described to me as being up in the air. It's in, essentially, we do not know if Josh Allen is going to be on the field this week. From what I understand, he is expected to be limited in practice and then will be judged day by day to see how he progresses. It is also going to be something of a functionality issue as well because sometimes with this injury, it affects the grip of the football. And as you could imagine, gripping a football, fairly important for a quarterback. It's not a pain tolerance issue. If it was, you know that Kyle Brand's guy would be playing against the Vikings on Sunday. It is simply how well could he grip a football and how bad is this injury going forward? So elbow sprain for Josh Allen and the Buffalo Bills, guys. What are y'all is coffee? Back with an update, bright and early. Josh Allen yesterday, man, it was wild. Everyone, you know, was speaking about this situation. and A lot of people were jumping out the window. Allen, surgery, he's out of here. It's, it's wild, man. Everyone's so nervous as Josh Allen, yeah, he's coming off a, a bad outing, a bad game, out coached, out played by the Jets. But still, MVP in my book. I don't know. But not that that matters. I mean, MVP honors mean something. But my Bill's trying to get that ring. You know what I mean? And uh, we're right in the thick of it, right in the middle of the season. Everything's hit, heating up. You know, any given Sunday out there. And now uh, things a bit more clear. Okay. UCL sprain, which we already know. And again, I pointed this out yesterday. You heard that there. He had the same injury back as a rookie. Um, back then, I think he was out four to six weeks or something. It was rough. But um, here we're hearing this may be something. Not It's not major. And it's something he can possibly play through. But this is where I'm almost like, I almost just want Josh to sit this game out. I don't. But you're hearing that this week right here when the sprain is fresh is is critical is key and you know it's like it's a big game every game's a big game again in this nfl season you know what i mean but one week of rest like what do you guys think what is your thoughts what is your feelings um no sense in trying to aggravate that thing i mean obviously he's getting checked out by some of the best doctors they work with these athletes all the time but um I don't know. You know, we'll we'll know as the week progresses day to day. This was scary, man. You know what I mean? Uh, Josh is that dude. And, you know, that, that strip sack there at the end of the game, the way his arm went back, it was scary. But Josh is going to be all right. Um, a sigh of relief for everybody, right? Man, whew, you know what I'm saying? So jump in the comments, everyone. Um, you heard that too about the grip, gripping the ball. Just, you know, I don't know. I almost just want Josh to take the week off just to play it safe, you know? So let me know what you think. Um, and man, that really was terrifying for a second, but Josh is going to be all right. Bill's going to continue on and get that ring. Uh, let's talk in the comments below, man. Like it, it was wild the way everyone ran with this one, right? You know, um, rap report there. Rappaport and Schefter, anything they say, um, Chef's word is a little more than Rappaport's word, in my opinion. But regardless, these guys got good sources. So go Bills. Get well, Josh. Play it safe. I'm out of here. Thanks for watching. Peace.